Alrighty, we begin the stream. See if the chat actually works. Perfect. Chat works perfectly fine. Yep. Game was game had Billy with Sega and Atlas. That's the good news. We're back with Sega again. Oh, I forgot commercial in the very beginning. So it's what? All right, I'll I'll definitely I'll definitely try to show the intro again. At least, or at least confuse you, at least can see it at the very least. All right, Susie, you on? Actually, testing my audio. All right, Ed, hang on. Okay. Let me, let me, go, let me go check my audio first right now for the moment. So hang on. All right, audio test. Is everything good? Yep, all right, here we go. Yes, we get to finally play this game after so long. Also, by the way, Susie, you see the Twitch chat? Is it on, is it on the screen? All right, here we go. Here's the intro. Made by Sega. Or co made by Sega. With Atlas. Just so you know. No, like seriously, I know, I know Nintendo's with Nintendo as she topped the 3DS type of thing, but honestly, if you can ever get a chance to go to like a, like a store or maybe order on like Amazon a copy of this game if possible, I recommend you do so. Right now, 
I would say low data. We're actually gonna do we're actually do something kind of interesting. First off, this is based on my final save data from the final battle from last time around. Yeah. This is a, this is actually original save data from like the final battle for me. And when you see the picture right here is all different hearts, so I've chosen certain characters. I'm not gonna spoil the spoilers a little bit. Oh shit. Um Ignore that sort of thing. Oh wait, no wait, no, no, I, need, I need to show something first, I believe. Do I need to show this something? I think it's like I think it's like twenty to forty dollars. I think. I think currently, actually. Hang on. Here's the fun part. Reveal-wise, it has actually a nine out of ten from Nintendo, like nine out of ten. There's actually no- this game has no sequel at all. Okay, Amazon you get for forty-five dollars. No. I think I, I think actually on the Nintendo eShop it was like twenty dollars you could buy it on there. Oh, I don't want to see the again. Yeah, you, you could have bought it. It's right now, it is kind of $50. It is $50 currently on Amazon, which is probably the best way you can probably you can get it. But, I hate to say this, but I, this is one of those games in particular I kind of hope they have a Switch release. Now, I believe actually if I'm correct, maybe it'll show the, it'll show the same intro type of thing. If it doesn't, and we get to the next little part, because I believe that intro right there. But so first off, we'll do a new game. We'll do a new game for the first, and we'll open up another save file. If it's actually correct. So here we go. Here's the intro. Where is this? We should be fine this far out. Put him down. <laughs> It burns. My body, it's burning. Hang in there. Huh? Don't die on us. Yes, that's right. I I fought and we I lost. Have to save him. Can't you do something with him? We'll fight again. I'm going to fight, fight, and fight, and then... Oh, look at that, there's... Don't lose yourself, please! I can barely see anything. I think I need glasses. Kill me. I don't care who. Just kill me and these dark emotions. Left like this, I would probably go insane. Oh, shit, I don't know. Is he using him back yet? Hang on. Wait, let's read that. Oh, yeah, again for a second. Actually, you know what? Let me check first. Let me check first, actually, if I can get in the eShop. No, you can get it now, but out of curiosity, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna check this first. While Susan's making her check, I'm gonna do my checks as well. I don't think she actually can get that on 3DS eShop now, because the eShop is now closed. But let's check. But I bought my I bought my actual 3DS as well. I also bought the physical copy. You can't increase more funds in the the thing now. But yeah. Here is the game basically, here is the game in particular, purchase demo, if you're a purchase, just for curiosity's sake, show you how much the price it is. On the eShop, if you actually had eShop funds, it was, oh no I don't care about, really? No I don't care about, the... seriously? 
Free up space. No, I don't want the free up space. I just want to at least show the price of the game. Yeah, here we go. Oh, here we go. Price right here. Yeah. On the Nintendo eShop, it was like, worth $20. And what you got in particular, when you purchased it, you also got like a free, you know, stuff particular. So he got like some, some photos. Right. You also got like a cool little, you know, uh, I guess you could say you got a cool like screen thing, right? I believe I should make my other 3DS, actually. Hang on. I don't think I actually can show it off relatively easily. Because that uh, 3DS capture card. Well, on the- well, Susie. On the eShop, it's actually worth- on the eShop, Susie. This is actually- this is how much it's actually priced on the eShop, Susie. And also, if you downloaded the game, currently. But you can't do the eShop anymore because that's what they got rid of it. Actually, I have seven dollars left on my thing. I could do some type of thing, but here. It's twenty dollars in the eShop, basically. If you have twenty dollars on there, you can go for it. But let me go ahead. Let me find. Uh huh. Here we go. Okay. Unfortunately, that's that's taste. So here we go. I'm gonna go ahead. And I'm actually gonna. I'm gonna zoom in for a second. Okay, let's go to the end. You know what? It's pretty much endless. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna be showing. Okay, here, hang on a sec. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go ahead and increase my size of my face cam for a bit. I'm gonna show something first. All right. If you actually have, if you actually have twenty dollars and you want to get a game, I recommend you get this game if possible. If you can't get it on this type of thing, but here, I don't think you actually can see this. But this is basically what you get if you download the game. All right. Cool little characters on the screen type of thing, and then basically. You zoom, okay, I'm just gonna show it real easily. I'll zoom around a little bit, Different. there's different witches on the top screen. Well, on the bottom screen, you have this little, like, pig-like creature, I don't know what it is. Basically just, you know, running around back and forth. Yeah, that's basically what you get. It's a fun little feature that you, they give you, you know? So yeah. I also apparently, I also apparently have my Mario Odyssey theme on my old 3D on my main 3DS. So hey. That's pretty good. But yeah, first off, Susie, we'll go ahead and there's nothing can do. But hey, you can at least buy the physical copy, Susie. Sure, it's $50 and it's pricey. But I think you could probably get it. Probably, maybe you could probably get another place type of thing. So first off, Susie, what I'm gonna, what I'm, Susie, what I'm gonna do first is show the new game, okay? At least we get to hold intro type of thing. All right, so here's the new game. Because it also will skip a lot of the stuff when you do like a new game plus, basically. That's what we're focusing on. Alright, Susie, you ready? Where is this? We should be fine this far out. Put him down. It burns. My body. It's burning. Hang in there. Yes, that's right. I, I fought and I lost. We have to save her. Can she do something? With well, if I can, I'm going to fight, fight, and fight, and then. Don't lose Hello. yourself, please. Hey, Gurgits. 
kill me. I don't care who. Just kill me in these dark emotions. I can't! No, my man playing Star Wars in the back. But we can't leave this! It's the intro. If left like this, I would probably go insane. I'd hurt somebody. What kind of game is this? Anime. In that case. I'd rather die right here now. You're contaminating the world! Yeah. If you're curious, Gurgus, Gurgus, do you have a 3DS? Gurgus, do you have a 3DS? Yeah. Yeah. If you get a chance to, and you have any money on your eShop, at least $20, you guys should get this game, Stella Glow. It is definitely really well worth it. Well worth your money. If you're not gonna use what kind of game is it? It's, an, it's a JRPG. And trust me, it has probably the best story out of any game that's actually not related to Fire Emblem. It's actually it's an underrated gem. Wait, what does JRPG mean again? Japanese role-playing game. Uh, it is definitely, and I mind you say this, if you, if, you, if, you don't, if you haven't, if you're currently on, this, on the specs of this, watch this entire series and you'll see exactly how good this game is. Alright, from start to finish. Yes, from start to finish. Looks like the world at. Oh. I will die here. That is the correct thing to do. But I have a favor to ask. I want you to promise me one thing. This world, keep it safe. The suffering must never be repeated. That's pretty dark to me. This is something only you can accomplish. I understand. I'll protect this, this world you love so much. No matter who becomes my enemy, no matter what I must sacrifice. Fast forward, this promise will become a curse to you. Still, I entrust my wishes to you. You have done well. So let us act together. Until the day comes when your soul will shine again. Well, this is goodbye for now. Well, bye. I can barely see your ship because, you know, my face is currently a bunch of, like, blackish red flames or pinkish purple flame. I don't know. I can barely see shit, you know. I mean, there's like, can't see I'll shit. I'll be waiting for your return! Well, that'd be convenient. No matter how when long you want, it takes, when you, you, when you want someone to be centuries. completely honest. <laughs> well, yeah. I'm not gonna spoil anything with this game at all. I kind of did that on accident beforehand. I'll still be there for you. Also, also, this game has voice acting, just so you know, which is great. Nice. It's also, boy, just so you know, the one of the big key things in this port. Goodbye. One of the key things in this game in particular are the songs. And let me tell you, the music of this game is phenomenal. I mean it. It is phenomenal. If you, if you want to do anything, you can't really play the game. Look up a soundtrack for Stella Glow and listen to it either on YouTube. That one, you know, you, video game website that always listens to music, anything, or if you can get, if, or if you can download a soundtrack, I recommend you do this sort of thing. It is phenomenal. It's a phenomenal soundtrack. And I'm serious. Prologue. Song of Beginning. It's a phenomenal soundtrack. The story of Elcrest the Hero. Oh, this is gonna be an intro, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna let this go through. Once upon a time, there was a god on the moon. The people worshipped this god. And soon, a kingdom was founded. The Kingdom of Regnant. While the kingdom thrived, the pe people's faith in God dwindled. God despaired over this, and sent an army of angels down to Earth to punish the faithless. Until one boy, Elcrest, stood up. Elcrest journeyed to where God resided, the moon. 
and gave his life to quiet it. Saved by his sacrifice, the Regnant Kingdom now regards and praises him as a hero. The end. And that's all for today. I'll continue the rest tomorrow. Aww! Tell us more about the hero Elcrest! Then... Wake up early and come to the square again tomorrow! Okay! Oh, right! Have any of you seen Alto? I saw him going to the forest this morning! Hunting again? Sheesh! Alright. So this is now probably the combat situation. Which means... This also means now basically this point. Is it, is it turn based RPG? Turn based, well, semi, sort of. What it isn't particularly. Oh, I better. You know what? You'll, you'll get to see kind of the combat right here. Hang on a sec. I have to go and like show the intro before we switch over to my new game plus save file. Specifically, kind of because I want to try to get all the special dialogues for everybody, at least, so you can get to kind of sort of experience it, them all. And don't worry, I'll really explain all, all the characters much better in, in depth. At least for avoiding spoilers. Mainly for at least the first two, like Alto and Lizette. Most of the characters I can say anything at all. So here we go. Oh, it just said. Is the intro anyway? Oh, that's the intro anyway. Really? Huh. Really? I didn't do it last time. Alright. Oh, shit. All right, here we go. This is basically the tutorial battle. All right. So here's Alto. I wonder if this is a good spot. Two our first enemies. Wolf. Yes. Jackpot. Today's a special day. I'm bringing them home no matter what. All right. So here's how the gameplay goes. And here's Lizette. Well, now it's full. Best situation, but oh well. It's just behind me, Lizette. <laughs> Alright. Welcome to the forest of the beginning. The base is sort of a tutorial level, basically. Fairly simple. Gold to kill enemies. Pretty obvious. So you know there's always victory conditions, also there's also secret conditions for every single map. Except for this one right here. There's also special conditions, basically. Here we go. Tutorial, turn order. Turn order is played at the bottom of the top screen. You can see which unit will perform the next action by checking the turn order. Turn order may change based on the action performed during the turn. If the unit enters the not acting, the next turn will take a short amount of time to arrive. Alternatively, if the unit performs a strong attack, the next turn will take longer to arrive. Other variables will also affect the turn order. Be sure to remember this when you are your strategizing. So the enemy's unit is going to an attack. So you know there's a sense everybody. But here I go. Tutorial. Movement. Select move to display out the range of movement. Choose destination for Alpha to move to. Now Alpha G knows skill that we evolve for Alpha has currently. Currently only knows double slash. It's all done with SP has, how much health points, his attack, his power this is power attack, power defense, agility, magic attack, magic defense. Luck, his gear, his weapon which has the like, one orb, which we'll talk about later. I am just holding the import to basic healing herb. And then special conditions. These special conditions are unique. Because it's actually done right now currently, when we get to a mission with really special conditions, it'll be something simple like say avoid taking avoid having no like Lizette take damage. Alright. Or it could be something else like say, you know, don't use it maybe like Deal like deal damage against a certain foe with a certain enemy enemy elemental attack. So like that very simple. The first attack that's mine. Tutorial attack. Does an enemy within your range you can attack them? Select attack to do so. Obviously. Secret attack. Boom. 
damage. The experience points. Note. If you, if you close note, okay, direction in battle. Yeah, okay, okay. Choose a direction that very turn will have a great impact on the outcome of the battle. The second enemy from the front of the right or left side will attack you with your actors. Attack from behind will your actors and that damage you deal. Same plot when you get attacked. Since they attack the enemy from behind, well, present damage is the same. This is actually honestly actually why I first like doing this sometimes. Same right here. And then turn around like this. Now the enemy cannot attack us from both sides, regardless. Yes, certain characters have their own special abilities. Counter, for instance. Abilities, yeah. Characters, characters have different abilities. For example, Alto's is counter. If Alto is attacked by an enemy, he will counter for enemies within his range. Your character's ability can be built for a boss game to pass that. So for him, he has counter base, meaning base will counter the attack. But also healing items, basically. Tutorial items. Use items you possess during the battle. If you get low on HP, be sure to use recovery items. This is my turn. So she has a healing herb, means I can use the on Alto if I wanted to. I'm gonna do nothing this turn. And then skill. There's also special skills that you can do the rest of the person's part ah, LP. If it's a skill, I would use double slash, and I would deal like 70 kills of damage. So I'm, not gonna, I'm actually not gonna do that. I'm gonna actually attack. Normally. Shit, sorry, no, I got point one. I did not see this. What? Oh, so your mic's fucking up. It's fucking up? No, it's fucking up so easily. Seriously? Oh, uh, no, shit? it was like... Yes. Wait, so it's just fucking up now? It's my turn. Oh, so I, I, I almost be quiet, maybe. That might be the case, is that right? Is it quiet? Yeah, there we go, it fixed. Oh, it fixed it? Is my audio a bit quiet or something? Let me go ahead and fix my voice audio. Alright, I gotta go anyway. My phone's on 1%. Yeah. Alright, talk to you later. Alright. All right, much better now. Audio now fixing increased a little bit. Okay. Next up, we're gonna do nothing. The enemies come towards us. Yep, he comes charging. Takes two damage, counter attack. Other enemies gonna charge. Next job we're gonna go for, I'll take be this. We do five damage to this enemy. Double slash, I do 8 HP damage, so I would say no. I'm ready. No, I'll just, I'll just use my special attack. We use, use double slash in this enemy right here. Alright, here we go. Experience, now you're leveled up. Now also level up level 2 now. Tutorial leveling up. Here's the interesting part of this game in particular. If you love, if you basically get a bit, basically beat an enemy and you level up, what will actually happen in particular... Oh, shoot, I got off the screen. What actually happens in particular, whenever you level up, all your HP and experience, all your all the HP, and, and the HP and SP you have used is immediately recovered. So look right now, his HP is fully healed. So he can see he's fully resort, you're fully restored now. Also, his tech also increases as well. Also, Lizette has no ability right now. Just so you know, 
she becomes much more relevant later on. Right now, she's not going to be that super strong. Don't worry about Lee's Rosette not being strong enough. She won't be strong enough at the moment. I have time to, I have time to take on the boss, basically, the wolf leader. It's my turn. It's my turn. No, it's taking damage. I could probably be killing her, maybe. No. Why are you wasting on her right here? Also accuracy with attacks, basically. If the attack actually misses, it's being danger. That would be a big problem. Complete mission. Tutorial mission. This was relatively easy. Got our gold. Look at all this meat. That could have gone really badly. Thanks for coming. You were a great help. Sure, but do you always come this far into the forest to hunt? No, but today is special. What do you mean? Let's hurry home. Everyone in the village gets a bite, they do. Huh? Hey! Wait for me! Well, well, welcome, to, welcome to Mithra Village. There's no Pyra Village, sadly. Sorry, Pyra fans. Hello, Mayor Bogan. My, you're ca carrying a lot. Looks like your hunt went, went well. Yes, it was quite the haul. Here, this is just for you. Ah, but blessings from the forest. We must give thanks to the hero elk. We were just running out of jer jerky. Appreciate it. You got all this yourself? Impressive. I was just lucky today. I had advised against it when Rosa took you in three years ago. But we, we should have kept you if we, we knew you'd be become such a fine hunter. No doubt about that. How about it, Alto? You should marry my daughter, Mina. Mina. Come on! Mina is eight! I don't think you're good enough for Mina. What's that supposed to mean? Who knows? Why don't we let these two Tell her go? Tell Rosa must be waiting. Home! Welcome back. Ah, so Lizette was with you as well. Listen to this, Mom! Alto went too far into the forest to hunt and... Alto's a boy, dear. He should be allowed to do that sometimes. Besides, today's a special day. Special? Do you mean... It's your birthday, you know. So, we, we wanted to hold a feast for tonight. Yep. Wow. Birthday celebration. You remembered. So, what do you think? <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. Except... But still, you shouldn't go so deep into the forest. Something thing happened to you. I. Uh huh. I couldn't sleep at night. What does that even mean? <laughs> well, we're having a feast, aren't we? Go rest up until it's ready. So yeah, Lizette is basically Alto's childhood friend. Like always in a lot of animes, you always, you always have that one person who's like the childhood friend. Then you have like the sun. You have the Sundre. You have the you know, weird, creepy lolly. And then you have, I believe, the. Here you are, the main dish. What was the one? What was the one? Let's try, you know, kill you, fix you for yourself. Wow. This game, this game, this game is not as worth a thing. It does have a lolly though, but no. yeah, she's more. Hey, she's a psychopath. I mean, she, control, she controls dolls. Um, huh. Living dolls actually. Like, Classic anime trope number number I don't know what number it is. For some reason, the lover of the main character will always make some sort of purple nasty surprise. Is is in every single anime. I'm not kidding. 
it's probably uh, ex excluding actually ones I pick actually, but the actual like female slash male love interest in particular in certain animes, where actually the person actually actually, actually can cook well. In the case of this sort of thing, it's the, it's, the, it's one of those things where it's like it's always like comedic comedic thing where the like, cooking actually is bad, but that she's funny. You're the one who made this stew, right? The parent, isn't it? Really? Really, a parent? I wonder why everything that you make turns out wrong. She should be making it exactly how I told her. Though. Get it right for sure today. Oh, it's alright. Looks as if your cooking tastes fun. Really? Of course. Well, you have to do this. And then. Yeah, let's dig in. Except, you don't want to do that. Also, the bite. Also, the entire screen oh, is. I'm stuffed. I'm just going to freeze. Did you'll be scratching your feet or something? I'll be scratching your feet or something. Play didn't actually freeze on me. Yeah, I am. Come on in. Play didn't actually freeze on me. I thought it would suck. I don't think I got thanked you properly for today. No need. We're family. It's only natural to do nice, nice things, right? I know that. Play didn't actually freeze on me. That would really would suck. Thank you, you Alto. You're very welcome. But anyway, I was just on my way to see you. What about? I was going to say happy birthday, and I wanted you to have this. This pendant. It's the one I had on me when you saved me, Lilizette. This is the only yeah, thing pendant. I have that I can give you. This is a unique no. pendant. Actually, it seems I, I can't accept this. It's kind of special at all. Sorry. Just Might kidding. It's actually time. very special. It's not that bad. This is the only clue you have to finding out who you are, right? It, it's all the more yes. reason for you to keep it. You accepted Mimi's family three years ago when I had no memories. And you gave me my, my name. That is precious to me. I, I don't think I can, I can ever repay you or Miss Rosa. So... I no longer have a need for this. What do you mean you don't need it? This village is my home. But Miss Rosa are my family. That won't change, even if my memories return. I don't miss them. That's why I want you to have this. I see. So, will you accept it? Of course. I'll treasure it. Whoa, it looks nice on you. <laughs> yep. Thanks. She's put on the, she now put on the, the special like Jam art of a uh, drum thing. Good night, Zach. See you tomorrow. Well, that seems pretty simple. Nothing bad happened so far. Yep, everybody's fully restored for healing. Let's begin. Hmm. Did it actually show? I'm kind of curious since. I need to. I need to check something first. Before I save first, I need to check something. I need to check and see actually if it should show. It showed at least the gameplay. So it really be bad if it showed different. If, if it skipped some stuff because literally. Let's watch. Hang on a sec. Just gotta make sure I can see it. Oh, here, right now at 38 minutes, that's good. Shows the intro. Title screen. I go ahead and do the intro type of thing. Then I go and show the prices. I am now showing off the thing you get download the game. Finally, the intro again. In that case. Intro. Intro again. Turn order combat type of thing. Shows gameplay. Didn't freeze.
Oh, it did freeze. Damn it. Of course. Of course it freaking freezes on me. Seriously? Seriously, it froze on me? How the freak is that supposed to... That's not right. Why did it do that? Seriously? It's weird, like, sometimes, like, sometimes 3S capture card actually will fail and actually capture and actually doing its freaking job. Like, it's supposed to capture the footage, not freeze the footage. Stupid thing. You're supposed to actually do your job. Capture. I, I gotta skip a lot of stuff. I gotta do a lot of skipping, basically, again. Apologies for this weird enough thing going on. Blame my 3DS capture card for freezing all the data stuff. Obviously this is a tutorial stage, so we're gonna ignore this sort of thing at the moment. Turn off a lot of stuff in particular. Just hang on. Level up. This is where I actually froze originally. Leveling up. So I froze last one round. This is what actually just happened basically. This is my turn. Wait, 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 I froze right there. Seriously? Also, enemies also have SP as well. So, their, their, their SP actually also drain as well. It's my turn. Here I go. 
the dig bug didn't get really any damage. Oh, this is perfect. I'll go. I'm ready. You're dead. Choice. <gasps> Hard slash. There we go. Mission clear now. Yes. Mission four. There's also special bonus clears. All right. Look at all this meat. That could have gone really badly. Thanks for coming. You were a great help. Sure, but do you always come this far into the forest to hunt? No, but today is special. What do you mean? Let's let's hurry home. Everyone in the village gets gets a bike too. Mithra Village, basically. Mithra Village. I mentioned before, basically, I'm taking a joke about Pyra. Mithra and Pyra from Senior Blade Chronicles. Hello, Mayor Bogan. My, you're carrying a lot. It looks like your hunt went well. Yes, it was quite the haul. Here, this is for you. Oh, what blessings from the forest. We must give thanks to the hero elk. We were just running out of jerky. Appreciate it. You got all this yourself? Impressive. I was just lucky today. I had advised against it when Rosa took you in three years ago. But we should have kept you if we knew you'd become such a fine hunter. No doubt about that. Yeah. How about it, Alto? You should marry my daughter, Mina. Come on, Mina is eight. I don't think you're good enough for Mina. What's that supposed to mean? Who knows? Why don't we let these two head home? Rosa must be waiting. Well, welcome to home, basically. We're home! Welcome back. Ah, so Lizette was with you as well. Listen to this, Mom! Alto went too far into the forest to hunt and... Alto was a boy, dear. He should be allowed to do that sometimes. Be besides, today's as a special day. Special? Do you mean... It it's your birthday, you know? So, we wanted to hold a feast for tonight. Wow, you remembered. So, what do you think? You're welcome. B but still, you shouldn't go so deep into the forest. If something happened to you, I... Uh-huh. I couldn't sleep at night. What does that even mean? <laughs> well, we're having a feast, aren't we? Go, go rest up until it's ready. Also, the moon apparently has a hole in it. Apparently. That seems kind of normal. Here you are. The main dish tonight is steak. It's cooked rare, just how you like it. Wow! That's so good! I think we have everything ready. Now, let's give our thanks to the hero elf for this meal. Great! I'm so hungry I could... Um... Do you I guess if you ever remember actually watching an anime, never like always like the it's like it was I could say the female love interest, one of the female characters. Sometimes sometimes even actually a childhood friend, or even more so, usually someone in particular. Like one of the one of the, one of the anime girls or even guys makes this like purple meal. Somehow, this is always actually one of the funny things in particular. Especially it's even actually funnier in like say like almost like like in harem animes basically. Cause always like that was always the one girl who was like, "Please eat this food, try that type of thing," or like, it's like, say, like, say you like it, and the person's like, "Mmm, this is good," except in actuality, it's like really awful. This like kind of this sort of like the classic purple surprise basically, is in the classic anime trope, which is actually pretty funny how they bring the. I mean, what's really funny is when, is when, I, when they actually showed this off in the demo type of thing. I, and I caught it on right off the bat. It was actually hilarious entirely. The purple surprise. Trust me. I don't think that doesn't actually pull up. It doesn't really appear again type of thing. But honestly, it's definitely a little classic, you know, 
It's a classic anime trope, basically. Lizette, you're the one who made the decision, right? It's apparent, isn't it? Really? Really apparent? I wonder why everything you make turns out normal. She should be making it exactly how I told her that. I thought I'd get it right from here today. Oh, it's alright. Looks aside, your cooking tastes fine. Really? Of course. Well, except usually, except, then. except honestly, unlike, unlike, well, I think either Alta might be nice, might be generous, it would be nice, but in actuality, the purple surprise that usually ends up happening ends up being actually ends up tasting actually horrible, with exceptions. There have been, been exceptions, I swear, I swear, the purple nasty surprise actually ends up actually tasting really good, but in most always cases, the main character almost always ends up actually kind of passing out from like eating it, or it always ends up being like, like he ends up passing out basically. Yeah, Let, let's dig in. Oh, I'm stuffed. I don't even want to look at steak for a while. I think I'll swing by Lizette. That's her own man. Alto, you awake? Yeah, yeah, I am. Come on in. you properly for today no need we're family it's only natural to do nice things right i know that still let me say it thank you alto you're very welcome anyway i was just on my way to see you what about i was going to say happy birthday and i wanted you to have this a, a blue pendant it's the one i had on me when you saved me lizette this is the only thing i have that i can give you no Sorry, not your taste, taste, huh? It's not the bad. This is the only clue you have to defining out who you are, right? It's all the more reason for, for you to keep it. You accepted me as family three years ago when I had no, no memories. And you gave me my name. That, that is precious to me. I don't think I can ever, ever repay you or Miss Rosa. So, I no longer have a need for this. What do you mean you don't need it? This village is my home. And you and Miss Rosa are my family. That won't change. Even if my memories return, I don't miss them. That's why I want, want you to have this. I see. So, will you accept it? Of course. I'll, I'll treasure it. Whoa, it looks nice on you. <laughs> Thanks. Today was the best birthday ever. Thanks, yep. Alto. Good night, Lizette. See you tomorrow. All right. Where's the sleep now? Moving everything over to the side. Save your story. Now we can fall now we can fully save now. Prologue chapter now. Day one. Now, let us begin with your very own story. Mm. What's that, that sound? A bird chirping? No. Is, is it someone's voice? It's definitely human, and, and coming from the forest, huh? Alright, we're down in the forest. It's this way. The forest lake now. The voices is closer now. Who is it? So you're the one. Oh, you don't, inter don't, inter you? don't interrupt the person who's singing, also. That's rude. You. Hey, what was that? I've never heard such a nice sound before. Answer my question first. Who are you? I'm, I'm Alto. I'm from the vi village of Mithra. 
Alto. Hmm? Strange name. Uh, that's, that's a little rude to someone you just... That was a song. Huh? I was answering your question. Uh, is a song? L like, a song you sing? But if you can sing, then who... Hilda. That is my name. Hilda. If you don't mind, would you sing that song again? You want an encore? Yeah. No one around here can sing. It, it was really beautiful. You don't know anything, do you? What do you mean? Long ago, God took away song as punishment for mankind's arrogance. Only supernatural beings can sing now. Witches. And is it, which is basically hints why the five witches are basically the five witches of the game are very important. Even children know this. Oh yeah, Lizette told me about that. Um, wait. Then does that mean? So. You're a witch? Who can say? By the way, I think you should run. Why? Oh no. Can't you tell? They'll be here soon. Q's enemy, Q enemy, enemy barrage. Enemy attack. Yep. Introducing slime enemy. Mind you, they do repeat a lot of enemies repeatedly multiple times, though. Are those beasts? No. I've never seen anything like them. You're right. They're not beasts. They're monsters. Mo monsters? Alto, was it? If you don't want to die, sit back and watch. Hey! You're going to fight them? Didn't I tell you to stay back? I can't let a girl fight by herself! Don't be so arrogant. You can't defeat them. Right back at you! I'm the best hunter in the village! Fairly well. Then you can watch from over the bay and behold my magic. Alright. Now, now we have. Is it Mel? Yes. Hey Mel, you, hey Mel, you missed a little bit of the intro. Just so you know, you have to go ahead and watch the intro again from the very beginning. Okay. You can kind of at least see everything. I'm not going to start our game over. So now we have some Hilda. Yes. Just so you know, Hilda is a unique character who will focus on. I will not I will not reveal certain characters in particular until after we end up getting to the point where you can easily throw things off a little bit. For the montage, I am starting off with episode one. Yep. What yeah. Was that? That monster disappeared. You're okay with that, right? That's probably fine. Severe punishment is in order okay. for children who don't listen. So you know, Hilda is, you know, Hilda is actually very strong, which means obviously we're gonna be dealing with some new stuff. Yep. Basically, this battle picker actually has you actually fighting three of the sl three of these slime jelly man, basically. In fact, a lot of enemies, a lot of enemies start, start to reoccur from here on out, basically. They will, they will actually start to, re they will actually start to reoccur and appear repeatedly. It's actually, it's actually purposeful, basically. Why is this purposeful? Oh, crap. You're surrounded. Be careful. You can double slash and then charge slash. I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna do any attack. I'm not gonna attack normally. Hmm. Yep. This is the game in a nutshell, basically. Hmm. It also kind of shows off Hilda a little bit in combat. Just so you know, Hilda's not an ally for us. Not yet. I can't see much. I'm not, gonna, I'm not actually gonna spoil anything in the game at all, besides my mistakes I did early on, where I chose some characters to play as. 
but I would have to reveal certain characters a little bit. We interrupt. That's how I do it. That's how I do it to bring you fucking mystery dungeon. No, I'm not kidding. It kind of reminds me of mystery dungeon with the whole, you know, grid like format. Grid like format. Yeah, that. Yeah. Okay. It's more like it's, it's kind of different. Also, so just why I'm congratulating you, Gold. I'll go. The reason why I'm congratulating you, Gold, is because you're playing Super Paper Mario on Saturday. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I have to level up. Oh crap! Hilda is gonna make her move. I don't want to have Hilda attack. My time is come. Hilda's coming closer. Nope. You can't hit me. Perfect. Oh no, oh no, you shot your fluids at me. That's rude. Oh yeah, your voting being played? Oh yeah. First, at first I was really confused on the whole Bruno Mario Party 5. But, huh? Well, we'll be brought, you know, I'd probably do in Mario Party 5 cha Challenge and Conquer. Mind you, mind you, mind you, I've not done Mario Parties 1 through 5. I've done six, seven, eight, and nine. I've, ten would be difficult to do, and I'll probably hold off on ten at least until I get a chance to get like a Wii U type of thing. It's finally over. That yeah. type of thing like that. <laughs> the options I gave them took are actually were some good options. I did, I did a couple of RPGs, and mind you, I might maybe after I'm done actually with you know this series on Twitch. I don't know what I'll do on Wednesday, but I think Wednesday I might go and bring back Bowser Jr.'s Journey maybe. Fit do that game particularly. Oh, yeah. Cause why yeah. not, right? Yeah, so why not? Do a lot of do a couple three days games back to back. Well, yeah. Do you still want to treat good. me as just a girl? You sing, and you, you use magic. You really are a witch, huh? Aldo! Jeez, tell me if you're going for a walk. I looked all over for you. Wait, who's this girl? Oh, uh, oh, we just met. Her name is. Leave your village. Huh? I'll say it again. Leave your village immediately. I will say no more. Wait! Mithra's a really nice place. Water and food are good. Everyone's so nice. It's not as big as other villages, but it's busy during festivals. You should stay over sometime. I know you'll just love it. You're not listening. I warned you. It's up to you whether or not you heed my words. Hey, wait! Where are you going? Goodbye. Well, she just hmm. left us. Yeah, Why Hilda's is Hilda, Hilda is suspicious. She's not from around here, is so she? So these anime people are can voice English. These days? Hmm. Say, Lizette, can you sing? No. Yeah, Hilda's outfit. Why don't you mind you? Mind you, you saw Hilda's outfit in particular. How it's just like whole like a witch hat, very almost like very revealing clothing and sort of thing. Here's the thing. This is actually, ironically enough, actually how I actually, re I actually noticed the game in the first place. I'm actually serious. Because of Hilda, I noticed it. And the reason why that was the case was because remember how I mentioned before how I hate, you know, Halloween Nowie, right? Yeah. Which, I don't, think I, I don't think I've even shown her outfit type of thing. Actually, if I could show it off, maybe, you know, you, I mean, you, I mean, you guys didn't, actually, you know what, I can definitely do that. Hang on a sec. We, we got we gotta show the terrible thing that is Halloween the first one of the worst uh, alts in Fire Emblem Heroes. No, it's Halloween Nowie. Okay. Now let's see here. This is is an alt in particular, in my personal opinion. Honestly, kind of why I really don't like Nowie in general. But honestly, someone actually gave, someone gave a quick edit for Nowie, and honestly, made it much better. Holy shit. Seriously. Okay. Why is it always the web PB, web PB okay. files? Seriously. Okay. Estella Glow, I am adding you to the to the list. Yeah. Well, actually, if you if you want if you can you get a chance to try actually playing the game. It's only twenty dollars on the eShop. It's like forty five fifty dollars on Switch, basically. Oh, so it is. Oh no, that's that's Switch. On. Amazon. 
Amazon or GameStop if it's possible. If you can find it at GameStop, maybe you, may, you might get lucky, maybe. So here we go. First off, I'm going to go... No, Amazon! Amazon! Stop! Stop! Thank you. My, my tap is... Amazon is doing its thing again, is it? Yeah. Here, here's the image for a second. Hang on a second. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to show up right here. This is actually... Okay, this is actually kind of why I recognized the game in the first place. And it's ironically enough, like, it, it caught my eye a little bit. I tried the game out a little bit. I really enjoyed it. But honestly, I do not... But basically, Halloween Nowy. Legit. This is probably this is probably the worst design. Worst, like, Al alt character in design in Fire Emblem Heroes. Especially for, especially for someone like say like Naui and for me. So, and it's also kind of why like like, like I said immediately after that we also got like Witch Mia, who was actually was a was actually, was actually a caster flyer, you know, witch mage who's actually much better. But for Naui, I did not like her at all. But you can definitely see why I didn't that's why type of thing. So honestly, especially because honestly because Naui is like literally a lolly dragon and she wears like such a very like provocative outfit. It was I didn't actually I didn't actually like it. Basically. Yep. So I went ahead in particular and looked at different stuff and all of a sudden I noticed, hey you know, there's uh, hey there's hey there's a game that it looks like has some has, has like has like a witch that's apparently looks like very similar. I got curious. I went ahead and I downloaded and I played the demo. I actually beat the demo. I enjoyed the game so much. I went ahead and I bought the game. At the time, actually, at the time, the game was only thirty dollars. So that's where I ended up getting the cool, you know, like I guess you know, like three DS, you know, back wall, wall tape, wallpaper backdrop type of thing. So as if it was worthwhile. Now let's, let's get back to the story. What? Don't be silly, Alto. Didn't we learn in Sunday school that people can't sing songs? We sure did. I have to get breakfast ready soon. Shall we head home? Yeah. No, don't, you know, don't, don't question the weird, you know, lolly witch. Who's actually apparently actually much older than you think. Tick tock, tick tock, and so it begins. Tick tock, tick tock. A story, a story that is all yours. Tick tock, tick tock. The rusty cogs spin, they squeak if, as if screaming. The cogs spin and the needle moves. Thousands of colors shine on the dark times. Tick tock, tick tock. The curtain has risen. Time to tell the story of the moon and stars. Tick tock, tick tock. Tick tock, tick tock. Oh, third time. Hey, don't pull us off limits. Don't let the children outside. Don't use the well either. Boil our stock of rainwater if you need it. What's all the commotion? Over oh, here. What the heck? What? What, what is? Oh, my. Lizette, Alto. We told you this place is off limits. What's going on there, Bogan? It looks like someone's trapped inside stone. Last night, Otto went on a hunt and didn't come back. We formed a search party and found him in the North Forest. So this... is Mr. Otto? It's ju just as it looks. We don't even know if he's alive in there. Is it a plague? Or a ah, curse? so that's the game. Okay. Maybe the yep. North Forest he, he's is been, to blame. He's been apparently Mr. stoned. I got it! What if we smash this stone with an axe? Apparently. <laughs> no, this is the, actually, Please, apparently on Jayfosh Fire's server, Evie <laughs> is updating her ways. YouTube banner. Oh, oh nice. You know when we decide what yeah. To do. Go home That's finally thing. Don't leave the house until we That's get like to the always, like, update your but, YouTube also, banner. These are your mayor's orders. Sorry, but yep. if, if there's anything I can do... I'll be sure to call you. You're the best hunter here, here after all. Look after him, Lizette. I will. So some monsters apparently apparently stoned or crystallized. I'm sure the mayor will have everything figured out. I, I hope so. Poor At Otto. any rate, shall we go home? I'm sure mom is worried. Yeah. Poor, poor Otto. He was innocent in this whole thing. Where were the both of you? I was so worried. I thought maybe you'd been hurt or worse. Like Otto. We're sorry. Our neighbor Mermina's probably crying. And her brother was just born too. 
Damn it. Why did it have to be, be Mr. Otto? This misfortune isn't anyone's fault. There's nothing we can do right now. I know that. But... It isn't fair! I'm heading into the North Forest! I forbid it, Alto! Miss Ro Rosa... You're too sensitive to other people's suffering. It's great that you can sympathize. But as your family, it worries me. You mustn't take it all in. The pain would control you otherwise. <laughs> Mom! Alto! Let's eat! Where did that come from? I feel like we'd be loose to this negativity if we mope around. Since we can't leave the house, let's at least be happy in it. <laughs> You're right. That's it for this matter then. Let let's not let's not let's not let Zet cook. Alto, you help help too. Those who don't work don't eat. You can peel the potatoes. I'll be making potatoes. Oh, gratin. Purple ones, right? Hmm. <laughs> I, I don't make food for meanies. Yeah, she makes. Yeah, Lizette makes her food purple. Classic anime trope. Yep. That should do it. I'll have to apologize to Lizette later. Apologize to whom about what? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> well, tried to get. And just where are you going so late at night? I, I'm just going no. out for some, some fresh air. Wearing oh. all that exploration oh. gear? When when you were told not to go out? Uh. <laughs> act on impulse when it's about helping other people. It's both the good and bad thing about you. I can't just sit around here. I know how you feel. But let's leave it to the mayor and his staff. If he feels he needs your help, he'll tell you. Your trip will be for nothing if you become too exhausted to help him. But... Alto. Alright. I give up. G good. You can head back to your room already. No. I don't trust you, so I'm bunking with you tonight. Huh? No, it's fine. What? Do it over. They're calling his friends. Did you know. he say something? Nothing. They're kind of good. Actually, they're kind of, they're kind of saying they're quote unquote siblings. Not really. Well, the summer here's a festival two years ago, I think. Here's the thing. I There's way too much. Siblings, sort of, but Alto, as she was found out, was found three years prior with no memory or recollection of as she was passed. Lizette oh, finds him. Takes him in, takes care of him basically, you know, with you know her mom. He's basically best 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 hunter of the village. You'll find out more backstory type of thing, but like, so they know they're siblings, right? No, they're not siblings. It is just oh, they, aren't? they say supposedly they act like they're siblings in quotation marks, but it's not. More or less, they are more or less. Lizette's told, like the childhood. Lizette is basically the basic what they like call the childhood friend in the anime trope. In, in a lot of anime harems, you almost always have one key thing, which is always being like the childhood friend. In high school DXD, the childhood friend was Irina, basically. Irina Shido, I believe. Hmm. Uh. Rosarium Vampire did not have a childhood friend in particular. Or if they did, or or, or I guess they think I guess Date Alive, which is actually a game actually Susie and I played at one point. We played Spirit Pledge for honestly, kind of had basically kind of gave up on the game. So I saw my save down on it, so I probably could actually go back to it if I wanted to, but it won't really matter here and there either way. But basically, the childhood friend for Shido actually was, I believe, Origami, because actually Origami knew him far longer than anybody else. But in the case for this game, Lizette is basically the childhood friend. There are actually there should be like five female witches. All witches are all female. There are actually five characters in particular we will be only meeting that'll be relatively important. And honestly, if you're playing if you're playing, if you're playing this game actually regularly, it's actually highly recommend actually at least to max the bond of at least the witches first and foremost. First priority. In New Game Plus, we're gonna be bonding with every single character. Purposely. Lizette and also, I'm not going to reveal too much about them in particular, especially when Lizette gets her transformation, to say the very least. Because she'll, she'll be transforming. I'm not going to say anything at all for her. The same thing with Alto, until like later on, when it's revealed, basically. With Alto, it'll probably be because she'll be able to lock in some special abilities. I have special screenshots in particular, I'll show off some of the stuff for them. Just some screenshots I actually have screenshotted, basically. Just so you know. But okay. for everybody else... 
So only these characters plus plus Hilda and a few other characters in particular we're we're gonna actually ignore completely. For everyone else oh and also and also another character as well. For everyone else in particular will show up all their stuff. Alright. I knocked out right. that night. And you got mad at me the next morning. I, I Alex, remember. Hey, also wanna hold hands? Well, why are you asking? Oh no, holding hands. That's the first trope actually of apparently a romantic relationship. It's it's the most sinful thing you could do as a couple. Hold hands. Hold hands? I'm kidding. <laughs> well, the night of the festival, we slept holding hands, didn't we? I just remembered that. Did that happen? So you forgot then? No, I remember. Why, yes, I remember it well. All right. Give me your hand. Here's actually the weird thing type of thing. Feels like it's been a while. This sort of thing in particular, and mind you, Throughout the, throughout the night, the entire village is actually going to be crystallized, everyone, except for actually for Alto and Lizette, because apparently Lizette actually survives because of literally holding hands with Alto, or because of the whole gem stone she has, she, she's actually had on her, basically. So literally, it's completely almost like luck that they two actually survive. Yeah. Good night, Alto. Night, Lizette. Well, yeah, that's it for the, that's it for the base of the intro. Also, the prologue is all this right here. That's just a prologue. This is all the prologue, basically. A small but happy village. It's almost picturesque. Agreed. But it's all the more reason we do this, yeah? yeah? Oh, new, new character type of thing. Trust me. This character, this character ends up being actually relevant right now. But you'll find out who his name later on. Indeed. Make your preparations, Dante. We'll begin as soon as Tete breaks. Understood. Oh, there Finish goes, there goes. Echo through throughout the land. There's his name, Dante. You have Hilda, Dante. Yeah, I guess he's right, I guess right here. This is sort of the end game type of thing. I didn't mean to show the top of it off a little bit. Day two. I have I have new I have new game plus actually for for money in particular for stuff type of thing. Oh no! I can hear it. This is a, a song. What's the matter? It's so early. You can hear it, right, Lizette? It's a song. What are you talking about? Witches can sing. Oh, it's got louder all of a sudden. You're right. I do hear a strange sound. So this is this a song? Seems so girl's soothing. Girl, you mean from yesterday? Are you saying she's a witch? I heard her sing this yesterday too. If she's really a witch, maybe she can heal Mr. Otto. How do you mean? We learned learn that in Sunday school, right? Witches can use magic. Maybe she can use her magic to save Mr. Otto. <gasps> Go back to sleep, Lizette. I'm heading out for a bit. I'm coming with you. Why? If I let you go alone, who knows what trouble you'll get into. <laughs> I mean, I want to help the village too. It's pretty accurate. Right. She might leave quickly again like last time. So let's hurry. We can actually exit our house. Up. Oh. There's Hilda. Hilda. It just stops. You you disappoint me. I've told you several times to leave the, the village. You're you're a witch, aren't you? We learned that you can make miracles happen with magic. Fine. What do you want? I beg you. Lend us your power. Power? We don't know what caused it, but a villager is trapped in stone. We can't do anything about it. 
If you could help us with your magic. <laughs> You two are very amusing. Hmm. What? What's so funny about this? Isn't a laughing thing matter wanting to see a friend from the village? Indeed. I suppose you're just foolish then. Good job. Hey Alto, would you say my name once more? Because here's the thing. Hilda is when I actually stoned everyone. Your name? It's, it's Hilda, isn't it? Yes. Hilda. Hilda? Alto? Her name's Hilda? What? You know her, Lizette? Hilda. The Black Witch. Yep. The Witch of the Destruction. Oh, how convenient. Correct. They always the Black Witches are same. always evil. And I am the one who turned your friend into a crystal. Oh, crystal, not stone. What did you just say? Hey, it's Dante. From Not Devil May hey, Cry. Hey, why'd you stop the Song of Ruin? The crystallization oh, isn't... Dante, awesome. Who are these runts? Who are you calling run runts? Who the hell are you? I'm the best spearman in the Harbingers. And the name's Dante. Remember it? Yeah. It's the name of the man who's gonna kill you. Kill us? But why? We're both human! <laughs> it's because we're human that we kill each other. What's with you? Enough, Dante. Executing the, the Song of Ruin is our mm. priority right now. Cover me. Got it. I don't trust him. Nope, you gotta, nope, you gotta, you gotta try to stop Dante. Except... Ah, uh, I, I knew I couldn't trust him. Running away, are you? Are you? Running. No, 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 we're not. Yeah. Come the, the way he said it sounds very evil. Oh no, some... Yeah, they're bad guys. Oh crap, ogres. Oh. So, they're, so they're the bad guys of this game. Yes. Monsters. Ah. I'll begin the song. I'm counting on you, Understood. Although I'm sure these monsters will be enough for these scrubs. These enemies in particular are probably the powerhouses. These are probably these are actually the third strongest enemy. Or at least the no, the fourth strongest enemy. Right. No, fifth. Fifth strongest enemy in the entire game, the ogre variant. Here, actually, is, this, theme, is there, is this theme particular you're listening to is actually the the harbinger's theme. This is the harbinger's theme. I won't let you lay a finger on this village. I'll do everything I can to save Mithra. Was well, so, that can't do anything at the moment? First off, first off, the witch. He's actually cute. Doors only have 27 HP, but the not that strong. They're definitely powerful. Is that, is that recommended if anything must get a chance to? Is listen to the soundtrack of this of this game. You can. I will put okay light to, to the playlist. Yeah, let's let's play let's yeah, the entire playlist. You yeah, I added to. to my library. Ooh. Counter. All right, also levels up. He's level five now. Also, these orcs also come actually with these orcs in particular are called come actually with counter basically. I'm ready. I'm ready. It's my Here, here I go. So that actually is very weak. I'm actually let you get this kill. At least we should get some experience. Maybe level up, maybe? Nope, check out the orcs. Well, well. So, you've taken them all out. <laughs> Impressive for country bumpkins. Too bad you're out of time. Ah. Hilda. 
listen to the song of destruction. The hell does Witch of Destruction basically? It's actually, it's, actually not, it's actually not held by actually true power, but you'll find out much later on when we fully get her as an ally. Right now, right now she's a villain. Uh, and this when everything goes, goes from good to bad. What's going on? You mustn't come here. Wait, you said right now she's a bad guy. What is she turning good later in the game? You'll find out. I can't spoil anything. Okay. One of destruction, sung by my witch. This is good. Everyone, get inside and lock your doors. What's happening? I hope you're gonna be too late. Because. Yep. Oh, nope. Already at her feet. What will we do? There's Chris we can't and everything. Just leave you here like this. Oh no! Go now and don't look back, please. And just close your eyes and escape. Make it stop! This is this is actually now we're actually this is actually where Lizette goes through a transformation. Mm. And yep. The entire village is not like this. This is not Mithra Village now. This Rosa. Everyone. This. This can't be happening. Amazing. Your, your voice carried especially well, well today. It's, it's the same as always. So, what are we doing with these two runs? Kill them or. They aren't worth killing. Hmm. <laughs> Let them go, huh? That's rare of you. It's your lucky day, day runs. Get, get out of here before Hilda changes her mind. <laughs> hey, you deaf or something? Hilda, why? Why would you, you do something like this? Because I am a witch. Oh shit. Could at least tell us. Give us a reason why. Give us a real reason. Stupid bitch. Turn the village. Everyone, back to how they were! Unfortunately for you, I'm the Witch of Destruction. The Witch of Creation, Although then. I can cast spells that wreak havoc, I can't undo them. What are you saying? Stop joking around! Don't mess with us! <laughs> Did you think I'd let you pass? Move! <laughs> At least you got spunk. You can't do anything in here. Stop acting like you can! <laughs> yeah, Dante and Hilda are Hilda's more stronger stronger than us. But I'll beat you down so much you'll wish I had. Out of my way! Bring it. Queuing now Mithra Village, now crystallized. Now... Unfortunately, defeat Dante. Dante's death. Dante is actually strong. I'll go. He's he's running at level ten, but honestly, he also has counters. Doesn't have counter as well. Bring it on. Why? This is that. Get a hold of yourself. I. I. Bring it on. Lizette is currently in a, in a state of, you know, like despair, basically. I'll go. 
You can't really attack Hilda though. Though I think you could actually attack Hilda. Or if you tried, but... Bring it on! You can actually win this fight, I don't believe. I'll go. I don't think I should win this fight, sadly. Bring it on. Nope. It's cutscene related. Yeah, wiggling. <sighs> what a disappointment. You weren't even, even worth my time. Whatever. Just lie there. Wait! Stupid much? I just said I was gonna let you go. You think you can stop me? We're not done! Damned brat. I won't forgive you. I will never forgive you people! Is that right? You want to die so much. I'll grant that wish for you. Dante! Die. Stop. Stop it! What? Damn it. I actually can hear the audio type the gameplay audio. Hopefully that she's perfectly fine. But here we go. Alta's now falling. What is this place? Oh, right. I was engulfed in that black, black flame and... I wonder if I'm going to die like this. I was yeah, the best like hunter in the village. 30, but I could protect a thing. Yeah, it's, well, it's, 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 only, it's only $20 on the eShop. The shop was selective, yeah. or definitely would have recommend you've gotten it. Alto. Yes. Yeah, I decided to just get it, get it physically. What yeah. Is it? So you can buy it at yep. GameStop, get it. My mom and I are your family now. I'm sorry, Lizeth. GameStop or you know where. I couldn't. Yeah. This house, this village, is your home. So walk around with your head up. You're Alto from Mithra Village. So there's no Pyro Village, sadly, just so you know. Don't feel bad. Pyro's um, no. overrated. No, 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 no! What am I doing? I almost gave up! She saved me. If I don't, don't protect her now, who, who will? I need to be stronger. I need the strength to protect those precious to me. So you seek power? Yes. Who's there? Do you seek power? I seek unlimited power. Of course I do! I'm going to protect Lizette. And I need the strength to do that! Then I shall grant it. But no, you cannot turn back once it's yours. I don't care! If you say you have power, then give it to me already!
Tune the girl. Tune the girl, aka stab her right in the chest. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Here's 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 basically, here's basically a little tuning thing. Each each of the five witches have their own unique little tune thing. This actually this actually happened a few times with each witch because all of a sudden sort of like darkness. This sort of thing is actually darkness for the one character. What was that? And where am I? What inspired this girl's heart? This voice again. To the girl. She's waiting for. Me. Yep. This is at the end of the area. Thank you. This is at. You can hear me, right? Answer me. I can't reach you from here. I have to get the closer. No, these special. Okay, no, these special areas in particular are unique. All right, only which is. Whenever you whenever you go and you tune a witch, that character in particular is unplayable unless unless specifically stated otherwise. I'll go. This first one with, with the set is very easy. Just run to the top and get talked to her. Um. I'll try to fix the settings a little bit. I need a chance to set first. Now we end up with these Zet basically. Now we end up with these Zet basically. Now we end up with these What's interesting about things is now is decisions. If you actually get if you actually answer the right decisions in particular, we'll give you right answers. I came to save you. And don't ever put them like that. I'm sorry. Thanks. At any rate, we have to get out of here. I don't, it's it's because my capture card, Susie. That's what's going on. It's the capture card. 
It's a capture card, basically, Sue. That's all it is. It's my capture card causing the little thing. Oh, he says you're back. It's this phenomenon. Hey, let's. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention to the chat. I actually missed it a little, so a little bit. And now, Lizette has not got a new outfit. Lizette? What are those clothes? I... I don't know. My body's so hot. It's weird. What's, What's going on? Conveniency. Lizette now can now be useful. Yes, God must really despise you. you. We'll need to regroup. Yeah, that's a retreat, basically. Come forth, my familiars. It's time to hunt. Now I summon more. Oh, more ogres. Seems it's a bit much for a couple of months. That girl is all our enemy. Kill but deliver the bull to me as you wish. Kill the girl. I, I need the boy for my secret plan of world domination. You're gonna die, girl. Stay behind me, Lizette. No. I'm fighting with you. It's too dangerous. I can fight now. I don't know why, but, but I can. All right. Right. Me, we're not gonna, I'm not gonna discuss certain characters a little bit, but honestly, Lizette for you, is now actually stronger. Lizette acquired Splash, Heal. Now Lizette is basically one of the, is the first support character you'll get, and honestly, probably your best support ally. I think I can actually add the settings like. Can't really. Can't do any. Can't do any settings edits. It's my turn. That's still strong, but now she can now do damage with, with Flash, basically. Zork's now level three. Ready. Instead. Yep. And Lizette actually now she can do stuff. So Lizette actually now is useful. She now use actually splash or heal. Here I go. Because now she actually deals damage to enemies. This power. How did I just? We, we can take them. Our goal, is, our goal is basically to defeat the ogres, basically. It seems pretty simple. Heavy strike. Double slash.
we're just gonna I think we're gonna safe at the moment. I also took some damage. We're, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and actually splash the ogre. Because that levels up. I'll go. I'm ready. And yep, took out the enemies. I'll slow up as well, level six. Ah crap. Bring it on. And now he'll now Dante swim down. Feel enemies. Now Dante and now is now much more of an interesting position now. <laughs> I think there could be this much of a change. Mm-hmm. Stand down, Dante. I'll fight them. Hey, wait! I can't can finish them off. Listen to my song. As you wish. Oh no, trying to turn into... Oh crap. More crystals are now spawning. Oh, arrows. Or lance spear. Oh, hello. Hilda, the witch of destruction, and her subordinates, the harbingers. By order of her majesty, we, the royal knights, shall capture you. The royal knights? Oh, how convenient. Got your troubles to just shoot out. Fine. I'll take you all off. I have to add the same thing. We'll withdraw. Sure about that hill, right now. Gotta add the settings. I gotta add the settings a little bit, increase the voice acting a little bit because it's a bit quiet. That's what I'll try to do a little bit. 1000 gold! Yeah, we got money! We have to follow them. Wait a moment. That will not be necessary. Our forces are already in for pursuit. Mm. Who are you people? Did you save us? Um, thank you. Thank you very much. It is the sworn duty of the Royal Knights. No, no thanks are needed. Mm. Ah, I have yet to introduce myself. I am Klaus, retainer and service to Her Majesty's Regnet Royal Knights. Why are the Knights of the Capital here? Claus. No, we need your help. Our village. Yes, we are aware of what happened. If we had known sooner, this tragedy could have been averted. Commander Klaus, we've completed the transport for the villagers. What's going to happen to everyone? To my mom? We are moving them to the capital. We will talk in detail once we arrive. <laughs> yes. Are you bringing us there too? Please, wait! I'm grateful that you saved me and Lizette, but we have to- Unfortunately, you do not have the right to decline. But from now on, you two will be placed under our surveillance. Under surveillance? But we haven't done anything wrong! I understand your frustration, but this decision comes from the kingdom. It's because of the power I just used. Isn't it? My body has become... strange. It's hot. <laughs> my, my brain's a mess. And I don't feel like myself at all. I am sorry to say this, Lizette. But you have become a witch. Dun dun dun. I'm just kidding, I'm just very normal. Haha, <laughs> it's kind of just a normal thing. Turns to a witch. Now we have day three. Not really, no day three.
this actually might turn the thing. I don't think this is going to turn the thing. Oh, this is about the intro. This is just the intro, basically. Save your story. I've had a chance to do some settings, maybe. So I don't get why the audio for the gameplay is much... But I don't get why the audio is definitely not right. So yeah, Alto and Lizette are leveled up a little bit. Chapter 1, The Royal Capital. Why is the audio so... Unless the audio is much louder, must probably because... Yeah, it's probably much louder in the headset. Told him to make a fuss. Can tell us what the capital is? World Capital Lambert. Seriously, can this capture card not do this to me, please? At least. Archibald's no now we're using Archibald. Yes. I don't get the I don't get the static the audio lagging type of thing. It's this capture card thing. Yeah. I really don't get to see what's going on with the audio. It is my capture card, honestly. I don't know why the f Seriously, is my capture card gonna fuck with me? Come on. It is the 
I can't fix the freaking. Honestly, I can't do anything about it because my capture card is being a piece of shit. I just need a new cord for it, seriously. <laughs> it's Omar. All right. Audience chamber. I, Klaus of the Regnant Knights, have arrived with the witch Rosette. Splendid. Raise the bar head. Yeah. There are five qualities basically. Hmm. Interesting. Medea, basically that makes, and they say if you were, now it's saying Susie, if you remember Medea from Fate, this is basically sort of Medea in a sense, in a way, so Medea is also kind of sort of like, sort of like a seer, who was also in the, in the Fate, you know, type of thing, Medea is also a witch, so honestly it seems kind of fitting that she also would make an appearance in this sort of thing. Oh, 
There's no way she did this. This is not this is really so pathetic. I can feel it pinching out of my heart. I don't get it. Why is the audio just another quarter? What is it? What is this? Wait a minute. Hang on a sec. Brief intermission.
smaller. So this would work much better. Just because I switched this back so easily. All right. Is that is actually made with the device? Maybe should not be the device. Well, this is probably this device right here. Probably the device. Maybe I need a new device adapter. Hmm. Oh, this is heavy. Hmm. If she were a true witch, she would be able to sing flawlessly. What are your thoughts, Medea? Well, I've never heard of a witch who couldn't sing. However, she did sing for a moment. Th there's no doubt Lizette is a witch. Are you sure you are not, not mistaken? Are you suggesting that I lied to her majesty of the queen? <laughs> <laughs> that, that's enough. enough. You may go. <laughs> well then, I will be taking my leave now, now your majesty. <laughs> the current situation regarding the Mizetta must be dealt with. But for now, let us re rejoice in the birth of a new wish, Lizette. There is no doubt that, that you are the water witch, and, and you are the only hope we have of saving this kingdom. Even Regnum? Indeed. From Hilda, the evil witch of destruction. Yes. This kingdom is in grave danger. Hilda has used her song of ruin to crystallize towns across the land. River. Gathering her followers. She formed a coalition called the Harbingers. With three elites. The third of the kingdom has already fallen by her hand. Wow, that's a lot. As a result, your town of Mithra has also been engulfed in despair. The Harbingers. Are they think they're saving people? Wait a second. Why the hell did we stop? Isn't this the royal capital? There are so many soldiers here. So why? Of course. We are treating Hilda at a high priority clinic. Then why not? Stopping Hilda will not save the kingdom. Restoring the citizens who have been crystallized will. Then, there's a way to save them? Perhaps. It involves a holy song. The Anthem. Hmm. To the Anthem Project. It's said to lift any and all curses. Seeing this crystallization as a type of curse cast by Hilda, the spell on the citizens should break if we recite the anthem. My mom too? And the other villagers? Of, of course. Then I'll do whatever it takes. If I can sing this anthem, everyone will be saved, right? Your enthusiasm is welcome. However, the anthem is not, not a solo piece. Why not? It is an ensemble piece. We will need four witches to perform it. Need four witches. Four witches? The water, wind, fire, and earth. The wind is to the south, and we are currently searching for the earth. I didn't realize there were so many witches. The water witch was the only one we had. Hey, yo. Hey, Lucario, man, you haven't, haven't heard you in a while. We can finally commence I'll try and catch up with some shit. Mm. Yep. But just so you know, my hometown village was now, was now crystallized. My childhood friend, who found me actually from... Basically three, but basically three years ago, when I had lost my memory, has been turned into a witch, which is actually good. And we also we also fought and lost to the Witch of Destruction. We have been saved by the knight by the Kingdom's knights. Conveniency, am I right? Though honestly, I don't. I think of any. I think out of. I think I think Lizette is probably the one witch in particular you don't. You could probably Witch Destruction. In her own right, because she can't cook for the life of her. <laughs> she can't cook. She can't cook for the life of her because, I guessing, you, is the car. You know, like in a lot of times in anime, or at least, 
in particular, whenever whenever a certain character always like cooks a meal, it always ends up being like purple and nasty, right? Not all of them, but yes. Well, in that case, it's one of those like it was one of those hilarious. It was one of those hilarious things that kind of it's like an early type of thing, but it doesn't doesn't really matter too much because well, our entire village is crystallized, so we got to kind of sort of so we just got to defeat Hilda. If you're curious, go back through the entire stream from the very beginning to at least see the intro, at least the opening. Or better yet, if you get a chance to watch, like, let's play Estella Glow, watch the opening cutscene, opening thing. It's definitely, it definitely kind of at least has that whole, like, anime-type intro, and you really kind of get into the game. I don't get why I'm getting weird static audio edit. I don't know why it could be the, if it's my headset, that'd be a big problem. Well, it's not my headset because seriously, this would be a big problem if the, if, the, if the actual headset in particular was giving me problems. What? What? The audio just... The heck? Your audio is fine. It's just the game audio is kind of low. Honestly, I hate to say this, I don't know what's going on with the audio type of thing. It's nothing I can do. I, I can't do anything at all. Seriously. I've tried everything. Oh, the audio... Of course. Of course. Please don't. Oh, God damn it. Oh, it's a different head chat type of thing. I can't do anything more because literally the headset. I think it's, I think the headset's get one's giving me problems. That's what's going on. My headset. Isn't that your newest one? Yes. And Ironic enough, it seems to be that for some reason, this headset does not like voice acting at all. <sighs> I don't know why. Like, seriously. It's... I don't know if it's, I mean, actually, if it's actually the capture card, or it's the headset. Because, honestly... Like, I wish I knew what was going on. Alright, audio's back again. Right. You think we'll be able to sing by then? So that means you'll have to practice. No voice acting now. They got rid of it. Base for the moment. The special night squad to defeat the Invictor. Goal is base to beat the Harbingers, which are based on the bad guys. Well, I'll try, I'll try folks to maybe have at least one, maybe one or two chapters, maybe a stream. Maybe this right here being the first chapter, being pretty much, you know, simple introduction to the game, right? And we'll save at least, like, the different, save the different, like, witches for their own chapter, basically. Okay. So this cord's a bit too small, though. I'll at least kind of get a bigger, the other bit cord that's actually slightly big. Oh, come on, seriously.
Might get, might get a slightly bigger cord. Just now I have something over the whole night exam. Also means we introducing new characters, I believe, as well. Yep. Look at what there's no audio. Excuse me, Commander. Myth so Mithra residents now been transported to safety. Lambert Treating Facility. All these people and innocents who have been really been, cr been crystallized by Hilda. Yep. Hilda basically kind of caused all this evil and destruction. So our goal is to kind of kick her ass. Kick that. Is the audio even actually... Is Audio actually even playing the, in the stream? You can sort of hear it. Okay. Get it. <sighs> okay. I don't know actually if you can hear the audio or not. Audio is definitely quiet in its own right, so I can. Sorry that I've been muted. I was trying to listen yeah. to the. Audio is a bit quiet a little bit. I'm gonna try to increase the volume a little bit. All right. Is the audio? Just tell me how loud the audio is right now, okay? Just listen to the music. Is it loud now? I 
unless you're counting the ad. Oh, of course it's a freaking ad right there, seriously. Unless, wait a minute, is it possible I don't have Ethernet running? Why not? Why it's giving me some lag and stuff? Uh, oh. And no, I don't hear the game audio. I can hear your audio, but not game. Why is the game audio... Really? It's his headset, probably. Hang on. Here, I'm, I'm gonna increase the game audio. Okay, Cario, how loud is the audio now? It's kind of quiet or something. Is it I quiet? Can, I can barely hear. I literally had to turn up my PC up to 100% just to Ser hear it. Seriously? Oh, wait. Seriously? My god, the 3DS capture card is now freaking out on me. And of course it does it on the one game I would care about. No, it's, really, no, it's just really loud now. Okay, it's loud now. Okay. Hmm. All right. Much louder in my ear now, but I don't think it's actually loud on the stream. Okay. Increasing decibels by quite a bit. Okay. It's a bit loud now. Is it louder now? I may have to mute myself. Testing. All right. Okay. Now I can hear it. Okay. Good. For some reason, it's like my new headset, basically. Probably using the other headset would have been perfectly fine, maybe. But now it's like, it should just be fixed now. Sorry. Huh? For what? Maybe it's all because of that pendant I gave you. I don't want to say that. It's for you. We probably died back in Mithra. Actually, I'm thankful. Thankful? I still don't know what witches are, and I'm scared of fighting. Well, because I'm a witch, I might be able to save Mom and the others. Not just them, everyone in the world who needs our help. That's how I feel. You're really strong. Plus, you'll be by my side, right? Don't pressure me, Lizette. Or I will pass. I will become a knight. That's all I believe in you. This test tomorrow, you should get to bed. I guess you're right. Good night, Alto. Good night. All right. I don't, get what, I don't get why they're trying to say show off. Night training grounds location. Is this where the video exams being held? It looks pretty empty. Mr. Klaus, it's me, Alchitil. 
Alright, introducing actually Rusty. Pretty accurate. Ouch, burn. If you want to be a knight, try starting with the Sassanthic Squad. I don't want to be a knight. I want to protect the Lizazat and save Midmira. Smart. So they've been dreaming for wonders. Hey, Archie. I'm going to take a nap to the exam success. All right. Yep. I'll pass. No matter what it takes. Yeah, obviously. Uh, spoiler alert, you pass it. Remember joining this team just so I can be babysitting. This is a serious mission, Rusty. Please use treaty to such. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Is this is where we're supposed to stay for the night of judgment selection stays in? The theory of the stun. My sphere creates some packets slash action. Oh, this seems the hope has started to get better. The selection example will now begin. Yep. Well, well. It looks like it's time to play in some new movies. Well, I'll explain their. I'll explain Rusty and Archibald's abilities when it actually shows them off. What a bloodthirsty group! Listen this quickly, Archie. You might want to hold back. Be sure to surrender before I hurt you too much. Hmm. Do you underestimate me? Here I come! Nah. Man, he's even more beheaded than you, Archie. I think you can carry it on our ninth, ninth regiment with such little skill. He's so strong. Monster! Not cowardly to be faced with death. Well, Doesn't the gameplay kind of looks like you would see in like a a mobile game? Uh, possibly. It has more of a sort of like, it has like a sort of a grid like format. Fire right. against Royal Knights, defeat condition none. My knife is real quick. You're gonna be dead in meat if you can't dodge. Obviously, best obviously best strategy in particular is to try to obviously you kill the guy. Is obviously to defeat Rusty. Prove yourself to the Archibald family heirlooms. My gauntlet and shield. If anything, our best person to try to deal, deal with would probably be Rusty. Best, best strategy is to take on Rusty, basically. And damage him by doing all these attacks from behind. Let's go. 
the enemies I can try the enemies can try to focus can also help damage Rusty as well. Rusty also comes with, comes with counter. So Rusty's also a second character actually with counter. I recommend I should attack Rusty from behind at all costs. So we're all gonna try to go for a focus on Rusty. It's actually it's perfect. Because now Rusty's not facing this way. Except now Archipald is now left. I'm not gonna focus on actually on getting Archibald because I have to kind of use to defeat Rusty if anything. So that's actually what I'm gonna try to focus on is focus on defeating Rusty. So I can definitely focus. I definitely can defeat Rusty. I can definitely defeat Rusty. That's for sure. Did he just leave? Oh hey Mel, you're back. <laughs> yeah. Oh crap. Rusty is still. damage but you can counterattack me so I'm gonna do this I'm actually gonna, or actually you know what I'm gonna do this do nothing here of course you attack me behind I'm gonna come completely cornered so Archibald actually is a tank which, when we get to actually explain who these characters are, you'll see exactly how strong they are. So here we go. Now we've got now we've got now we've got Rusty in good position. That is enough. So I thought we're ready. I was just starting to have fun. Rusty, lower your blade. All right, all right. This is how strong your lights are. Because you are the only one left, only one left standing, Alto. Fine work indeed. Yep. You can actually, be, you actually could actually beat Rusty. You gotta actually time your. Sorry. What do you think of Alto's abilities? He's terrible. His attacks are one dimension. Way too easy to predict. It may work worth fighting BBs to the force. For the ninth. <laughs> That's set. He moves fluidly and his intuition is sharp. Same passes. He was the only one who was a spirit fitted of the Night Ledge Legend. It appears to have worthy of being addressed as by name. My, my apologies, Alpha. <laughs> yeah, he goes. Yeah, yes. I passed the exam. Yep, we passed the exam. How convenient. It was so easy. I did it! <laughs> you, you passed a really easy exam, basically. You're always gonna pass no matter what. There's no. Also, it's now Knife Regiment Knight. Claws has joined your party. Rest has joined your party. Archibald has joined your party. Yep. <laughs> Here comes the babysitting. What was that? <laughs> Just so you know, Rusty ends up being a very... For me, when I, when I played through the game, Rusty was one of my more my core players I'm on my team before I got all the witches, basically. And I stopped using him, basically. Well then, he, you know, then these are Night Squad Barracks. Night Barracks is amazing. Don't get your hopes up. Come on, let me go. Wow, it's so beautiful inside too. That looks pretty normal to you soon. Let's play, let's go. Let's your room from now on. 
Cut some, cut some slack. That like, like, exam came out of nowhere. Just be glad you have a room at all. Might be a desperate, you know how you can clean, how to clean yet? Uniform. Night uniform. It's crap, but rules are rules. The current will go in your ass if you're not wearing it. <laughs> Can you call me Rusty? Yep. Now it's now it's evening. This all happened actually in the span actually of three if not four days basically. Otto, can I come in? What was yeah. that? What was wrong? Why did Sasai? So much happened today. You're right. Yeah. You were just simple villagers. But honestly, I was worried. I was really happy you fought by my side, though. I'm glad to hear that. And as I watched you take your exam, I came to a decision. I'm going to do everything the best I can. We're new to this, so that everything will go perfectly. But there'd be no reason to be here if I wasn't going to do anything. Yeah, you're right. I barely see school. I'll have to work really hard to keep up. Yeah. Let's do it together, Mr. Newbie Knight. <laughs> <laughs> yep. They do have they do have a special a special relationship, basically. I mentioned before. Hey. Right. Well, yeah. Bit of a spoiler, a little bit. All the characters you have so far, you'll notice that a lot of levels of the certain characters are pretty high level. It's on purpose. It was you. So based on that, I'm on level forty plus when I fought the final battle. If anything, the final in on my on my 3ds account in my main save file is slightly different, mind you. Lizette is very weak. So we'll be using Lizette a lot in these early battles. All right, so it's morning now, mm -hmm. fifth day basically. All right, I'm ready. This uniform is it really? Is this really? Is it really what a knight is supposed to wear? It's kind of embarrassing. Good morning, Otto. Commander Claus is looking. What are you wearing? I'm not too so surprised. Damn, maybe we should take it off. Sorry, I'm sorry, I just wasn't expecting it. Night uniform, right? It suits you perfectly. Let's try to make me feel better. No, it doesn't look good. I'll say it really does. Alright, alright. I'm not gonna give you anything because you're being nice to me. Come on, let's go. Let's go. When we get a chance to, I'm gonna go try to show up at least different characters basically, so hang on. <coughs> good morning. <coughs> hmm, here's it. And we can look at how to quit in the proper clothes. clothes. Why are you stung, Alto? I tell you making fun of me, Rusty. Uh, Alto does that. Good morning. Today's mission will be to defeat the monsters in the Eastern Force. Please prepare beforehand. Prepare? The Royal Capital contains many shops which are quite useful to us knights. Let's go introduce yourself. Kind of him again. <laughs> welcome, welcome to different shops, basically. So here we go. No, the reason, no, this is the reason why I did New Game Plus in particular. The center of Lambert, Main Street. Oh, so many people here. Press me to it first. You used to it soon enough. Look at this map. Lambert map. There's two guys I know. Bianca's Armory sells weapons and suitable items. Franz Altier and sells jewels called orbs. Love, so they love us there. Say your night and I'll help you out, no problem. So basically, this is based on, this is the whole like this is the main like hub area. All right. Now explore the Royal Capital. Royal Royal Capital. May have still will Captain Aid you. Open the menu. It's not a menu type of thing. So here we go. Mission time. You open the menu base right now. So here's the menu of our characters basically. You can do some stuff with like type of thing. Different characters. Oh, here we go. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna turn on the attack movie. So attack movie, attack movies are gonna be on now. All right. Okay. And storage is what you have, all the items we have in storage, basically. Right, all different items we got, type of thing. Yeah. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go to Bianca's armory first. 
This is Bianca. Yep. You're a part timer. But is it a shop called Bianca's Armory? The owner says I'm traveling the world, so I'm basically running this. How convenient! I might as well change the name while I was not at it. That's how it looks. Yep. Exactly. We've got everything here. Weapons, armors, accessories, items. Well, tutorial shop. Obviously, you know. Obviously, obviously, you know how shops go, right, Mel? Yeah. So here we go. First off, we're gonna buy some weapons stuff to things. So we have a hunter's sword. We can now buy a short sword for Alto. And we'll sell the old weapons. Hunting vest. We give her leather vest and sell. With Lizette, we'll buy a shell. We'll buy. A, oh wait. Wood staff. Buy a shirt for a cotton shirt. We're not gonna do anything we're out for these three right now for the moment. But Lizette, we can also buy surprising enough actually this gem area gives a special ring. Here I'm gonna give actually a magic ring for Lizette. And then Alto for right now give him an attack ring. You can also buy you now so mana fruit, which honestly in my opinion, I think is much more useful than really the healing herb for the moment for us. So I'm gonna give those actually to like to Lizette right now as well. So now we have two mana for some mana fruits. You also can buy buy the storage as well, some mana fruits as well. Which right now I'm gonna buy like another dozen. And that's it basically. Next up, friends okay. out Friends basically orb shop. Friends out to you later. Welcome to Welcome. Um I was told to come here by a guy named Rusty. Ah, uh, friend of Sir Rusty. I'm Franz, the owner of this shop, and, and this is my daughter, Renna. Yep. Nice, nice to meet you. you. My, my name's Alto. Nice, nice to meet you too. So and this is. Are these some kind of jewel? Yep. Oh, these nose actually orbs. I've never heard of orbs. Yep. No, no. This is my first time. Then allow me to explain. These are some special jewels called orbs. Orbs can have very strange effects. They're, they're known as Mr. Jewels. Here in the capital, we, we use them to light fires and sanitize this water. Whoa! Me and my, my papa put, put orbs in weapons. You put them in weapons? When you put yep. an orb into a weapon, the weapon will gain new properties. For instance, Mel. I guess, in, I guess I'll, I'll probably explain much more clear, uh, clearly in a way. For instance, let's save yourself a sword, right? You know how, like, you, yeah. have, like, you have a sword, you want to give a fire like property, have to do fire damage? Give yourself a fire orb, yeah. and boom. Now the sword does fire damage. Right, or mm. someone or whatever yeah. actually deals like damage and actually poisons people. Or you have like a bow. You want every time you shoot someone, it immediately paralyzes them, right? Or knocks them to sleep. Status is gonna be really effect, really crucial. Here, part of the aim orb, attack orb. Are you sure? Oh, don't worry yourself over it. Mm. We have the answer plus stuff at the moment. This store also sells a wide variety of orbs. Please, buy whatever you like. You also know she also craft orbs as well. What, what can I do for you? What, you can buy a storage, you buy yeah. aim and attack orbs. I will buy a couple more more attack orbs in particular. Thank you very much. And also now you can do this sort of thing. So now you can equip orbs basically. So now basically the orb you use, the attack orb is now added on there. Claws Lizette. I'll just put the attack orb on there as well. Rusty. Attack orb on him as well. Put the aim orb and an attack orb on cl claws. And we'll leave Archibald off to the side, ignore him a little bit. And there we go. Normally I don't have as much money. I'm not gonna spend a lot of money right now, if it's purposeful. Alright, gotta hang on this babe thing to get him now. Now. Next. What store is that? The line is huge. That's the biggest pastry shop in the whole damn city. We recently got a killer review in this famous guidebook called Mr. X's Just Desserts. Oh, you pastry shop to all crowds? Just this guy, I think only helps in the staff capital. How do you people so oblivious to dangers outside? Now go to Alto's room, basically.
There's also where also room is based where you're allowed to actually kind of sort of save your progress, basically. <laughs> basically, it's sort of like where you're able to kind of sort of save to a summary. <laughs> so, first mission also set received the night vision. Has a summary of basically everything that happened in particular. I'll definitely end up on the stream after we at least get before, we, before chapter 2 begins, okay? So if okay. We, so that way, let's do some tutorial stuff. So first off, we're introducing three new characters, basically. Alright? Okay. Try to keep you waiting. Not a problem. Are you finish your preparations? Yes, I think. The Eastern Force is close by. I'd like to set out, but first... Also, are you mentally ready? I am. You guys look like you're scared to death. By the way, also, in this night squad, newbies ought to carry the superior's bags for them. So I'll give you the honor of taking mine. Yes, sir. Rusty, you should not lie to your peers. What? You were lying, Rusty? Come on, it's just a little joke. If you wish to tell a joke, you should at least tell a funny one. You wouldn't know a funny if it hit you in the face. I have naked girls can make you smile. Naked, excuse you. We're in the presence of a lady. Stor <laughs> hey, she laughed. You, how can this regiment hold themselves with pride and honor while you are still around? Hey, I'll just lighten the mood a bit, you know, to make them feel welcome. Is this really gonna be okay? These two are complete opposites, however, they're both extraordinarily dependable. Well then, let us depart. Everyone keep your guard up. Yes. Just so you know, you'll, you'll need- Mission time. So, basically in a sense, mission time. By the way, just so you know, every single character should be- need to be- Every single character in particular will need to be at least level 25 by chapter 8. Okay? So, okay. there might be some grinding I might do off screen with some certain characters, maybe. Also, here's the world map. The destination has arrived. Also, do you remember what our destination is? We're going to the Eastern Forest. Right. So here we go, map, map, tutorial world map. You reach destination via the world map. On this map, there are various types of icons. The yellow icon will start a story event, while red icon will start a battle. Please move also to a red or yellow icon. Furthermore, if a green, the green icon is royal capital, you can access it at any time. There's also special icons you know for, like a blue icon. Those are always actually, those icons in particular, or as a matter of fact, are basically like special play coin, like boss icons. Some in particular actually do have play coins required, which for us right now, our 3S has no play coins. I believe I should know actually. Play, uh, the 3 believes zero play coins on our 3S capture card. However, on my main 3DS, I had over, th I had over three, I had 300 basically. So, let's play. Play the monsters, basically. So here we go. This is the location we see reports from. Up, oh, archer enemies. Up, oh, archer goblins and some ogres. Wow, it looks like they're happy to see us. There, there are so many monsters. There's only a few of us. Also, Lizette, if you feel danger upon you, retreat immediately. It's a real battle. If you let your guard down, you'll be very well, you may very well lose your life. Yes, sir. <laughs> so this is a team battle. That's nothing, it's nothing like the hunts I go on. I'll have to be careful to drag your lures down. Hmm, no mindset for such a young boy. As you say, this is indeed a team battle. Depending on what your teammates is vital. Your mission is to eliminate the monsters of the Eastern Forest. Everyone battle formations. Eastern Forest. Welcome to Eastern Forest, basically. <laughs> Alright. Alright, the mission everyone's required. There will, always, there will also be certain missions in particular that will require certain characters. It's also kind of why the whole okay. level thing is... But first off, interesting considering characters will pop up. Rusty first. I'll handle this. Here we go, here's this Rusty. Now, hang on a sec. I'll show an image type of thing. So hang on a sec. We find Rusty, basically. Ah, here we go. So here, here's 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 Rusty in particular, a little bit. This is Rusty a little bit. 
And what he basically gets for abilities are all these abilities right here. All right. Just to kind of show you off a little bit what he gets. And these are the current levels. Okay. Upon, upon his level, upon type of thing, upon joining, he'll only he'll only have himself st staff and knife throw. Those are his current abilities he has right now. At around level nine, which is the next level he'll, he'll unlock, basically, is chakra, which is basically cures on illnesses. Then he also learns fatality at level fourteen, which definitely do a, does do a lot of damage, especially with statuses. Mug, based on match to steal items basically from other people. Backstab, two physical critical hits to one enemy. Mainly works much better there's double clutch level 29 physical attacks to one enemy if hit may if it hits may attack again not ele elemental and beehive which is level 34 which is physical attacks to all nearby units passive is actually his counter and then parry which in a sense for the first one which is for rusty you saw before counter in the in the, I guess in the battle is that what he will do in particular is will literally whenever you attack he'll counter back with parry he'll do the same thing like It'll basically it'll block an attack, which also can be added with a counter. Infiltrate, which is by Infinity Rank 1, first through squares blocked off by Guardian. Sprint, Affinity Rank 2, movement is unaffected by terrain. High jump, Affinity Max Rank, plus 5 jump height. That's actually it for literally Rusty. That, that's Rusty. He's a Dagger Master. He's also he's heavily speed based character, so. So they don't with this. Here we go. Also oh lose that. Watch my movements and learn how to true knight fights. This is now claws. Klaus. And Claws is a bit interesting, I will say. Alright. Which I believe actually shows his abilities he gets. Alright. So here we go. Here's what Claws gets. Claws has Healing Light when he joins, which basically heals 30 HP for self or an ally. Really close by. Lion's Roar gets when he joins physical attack, physical attack to a line of units, non elemental. Thousand Strikes heals physical attack to one enemy. Purifying Light, cures their own or even ally, or ally status ailments. It's both sort of support. Blue Meteor, which is actually as strong as attack, will deal damage, physical damage to all units in range. His passive abilities he gets are Guardian, basically. Guardian, which he gets when he joins. He's level, level 17 Desperation when he gets level 17. HP Recovery in Affinity Rank 1. Magic Shield, Affinity Rank 2, which, is actually, which, is, which you actually kind of need specifically for him. Get him actually a magic shield for your basic affinity rank 2, and you'll be set. Intimidate is level 22. Alright. Okay. Um, next, last but not least, Archibald. I, Archibald, will go for. Archibald is unique. I did not use him at all. I literally kind of scrapped him. So here we go. Here's all the abilities I should Archibald has. Okay. Okay. So Archibald comes actually with Malta's March and Arc's Impact. Arc's Impact. Malta's March is a physical rush to one enemy. The gates counter. Arc's Impact is a knockback to one, one enemy. Brother in Arms level 10 as defense up to all nearby allies. Weak Grosso. Physical quest to one enemy, negates counter, adds defense down. Dave's Meditation, adds HP to regen, HP to regen itself. Zephyr's Siege, physical, physical, physical attacks to all nearby units, adds negate move. Rampage, physical critical attack to one enemy, basically. As for his support, in particular... Honestly, I kind of think I should, I kind of think I should download all this early on. Here is now his passive abilities. Guardian, upon joining, adjacent allies are impassable by enemies. Defender, upon joining, may to get damage may to get damage dealt to an ally. Vitality at Vita rank one, take less damage when the HP is when HP is down. Guard proficiency, affinity rank two, increase range the range and rate of defender activation. Movement up, affinity rank rank max, increase movement by two. 
Archibald, in my personal opinion, is like a walking tank. He is super slow. Okay? Okay. But he's also powerful. So that's the whole thing with him. He's powerful, but slow. Now, Lizette is going to do another type of thing. Mind you, I'm not going to show Lizette at all because it's going to show Lizette a little bit. Because she's a witch. So, I'm not going to show her off until we get to after a certain chapter point. The Vent Terrain. Some terrains have an impact about something you can't even land on. In obvious case, if you recall, you can't land, you can't land on lava. Pretty obvious case. Enemy to enemy damages. So the boss actually is the orc leader. So yep. Those damage the enemies relatively easily. It's basically kind of it. Yep, we're not gonna defeat the enemy. There is also there is also critical hits as well. I will say, you can't actually get you can't actually can't get critical hits. Up to defeat two or more enemies. Let's hit to defeat one or more enemy. Oh, yeah, you can have to have also defeat an enemy. So you have to have also actually defeat an enemy. Yep. Enemies actually with range are going to be a bit annoying. Can't damage the enemy a little bit. So Lizette needs to actually at least finish off one of the enemies, if possible. For a bonus, <coughs> for bonus request achievement. Or, or to use Heavy Strike. Miss. Counter. And now the enemy, now the orc's now low in HP. Which is perfect for Lizette. Archibald is pretty much just a tank type of thing, so ignoring Archibald a little bit. Alright, we'll do this. We'll, we'll use charge slash. Take too much damage with him. But we need to have, need to have Lizette take out one of the enemies. You can also, if you also get like a crit, you know, do, it does more damage, which can be, definitely happen in certain factors. Or more so, for instance, like certain elementals, which we'll find out about elemental stuff later on. That takes damage. Lizette is, not actually, Lizette is actually not strong at all. But, Lizette actually can finish off the enemy. The bonk. See, there's, there's, see, there you go. There was a critical. Critical hits actually can actually happen. We also complete actually one of the cheat one of the special conditions. Which, in fact, is none other than enemy 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 gets takes his damage and is defeated by you. Heavy strike. The counter. See how strong Rusty is, basically. <laughs> See. So, Alton needs to defeat two. 
Really? You missed? Archfall has no- Archfall is also- I mean, Archfall is definitely just a tank, that's all he is, basically. Archfall definitely is a powerful powerhouse. You can, you can just- you can just damage the enemy level 2 for heavy damage. So immediately knocks the guy- damages the guy. Is that? Oh, is that low in HP? Oh, crap. Let's go, go. All right. Here we go. He'll use, use the healing herb. There's there, there base item usage, basically. Hmm. the moon right now. I'll just move over here. I try, I'll try to try at least defeat the one archer. Those two enemies... Oh. Let's do nothing. I'll try to defeat the little achievement type of thing. There we go. Now I can at least damage and defeat this guy. Try to defeat the ogre as well. And afterwards, finish off the other enemies. Oh! Are you asleep? No. no. I don't know. Archwell will probably take some damage against these enemies. And there's 22 worth of damage. As is possible. Archwell is a tank. Doing the moment. Also, not close. Train come by. Yep. Heavy strike. I've checked, I've checked, you do a lot, of, did a lot of damage. Now we can use, now we can use Splash on this one orc right here. Which kills him. And the Zek gains a lot of experience, his not level up, unfortunately. Let's go. Orc leader is not going to move yet. Let us killing light on the Zet. And now I'll take a fish off his enemy. Both special, both special conditions have been met. He's also for a special things you can do in missions in particular. And he's not gonna make their move now. Of course you miss. How convenient. There we go. Now, now, now the guy Archer took damage. Let's 
So yeah, build, big character items that actually certain characters have their abilities. So yeah, basically you have yourself, you know, a sword. You have your sorties. You have lances, bows. Some people even use actually axes slash scythes like Hilda. And then you also have yourself. And then you also have people actually use actually like. I would guess you could say like, one character in particular actually uses actually one character actually uses actually one character in particular actually uses actually chainsaws. Yes, chainsaws. Why? I don't know. I mean, Archibald uses actually uses actually a literal literal gauntlet. So it looks like the guy's nearly defeated. I'm gonna charge him off. I don't give, give Lizette this kill. Focus. Yeah, all, all, all enemies also have abilities as well. All enemies also have abilities as well. Alright, so now focus. So focus in particular actually increases actually your crit rate. You won't release for, for enemies. Basically, in a sense, what you see is on the top screen, right? Yeah. So yeah, only so basically, basically on the top screen, actually, is the gameplay. Well, the bottom screen shows exactly everything you need, from status, skills, and then missions. So here we go. We got ourselves an aim orb, healing fruit, healing herb to mana fruit, and you got yourself an orb meister and a debuff staff. So new build, new items, everything for our characters. Yep. Here's, here's actually what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to try to, I'm gonna, I'm actually going to try and make a plan, try to least of anything, get, do all the side bonus missions. For every single one of the every single one of the main missions type of thing, if possible. Right. <laughs> okay. So this means I'll probably be setting if I mess if I mess up. <laughs> that magic is amazing. Also means this also actually means in particular if I'm actually correct is also yep. Here's the interesting thing: you'll, you'll see this picture again multiple times, but like it'll actually will change with more characters you get. Hmm. Well then, that we have for today. Our next mission begins tomorrow. Rest well. Yes, sir. All right, I'm off to find me some ladies. See you later, Ralph. <laughs> what? Yeah. Here's the fun part. Also, doesn't need, need to search for ladies because ladies actually will find them. So I'm suddenly so tired. Me too. My music muscles are really sore. We should get into bed early then. I'm going to head back to my room. And now it's night time. Yeah, it's probably just now we must. Well. I almost kind of forgot a little bit. We'll reveal the second chapter a little bit, sort of thing. Just so you know, there's, there's, uh, there's, uh, there'll be some points actually where there'll be voice acting, and other times there will not be voice acting. So I'll try to read the lines for those when there's no voice acting. Come on, okay. You sound like some old drunk 
guy at a bar. But this milk tea is so good. I always want some, something sweet after exercise. Well, well <laughs> you did put, put in a hard day's day work to today. Oh, yeah. I almost forgot. Uh, sharp red cookies from the Reagan Market Bakery? I, I remember you, you said you wanted to try dry pastry streets from the capital. Well, I, I saw these when I was out earlier, so I brought some back. Can I really have them? I wanted to try these ever since I saw them in Mr. X's just a dessert. Let's see if we get to sale. Mm -hmm. well, I'm, I'm Won't we kind of spoil something a little bit on who I'll Mr. X one. is? Mel? Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna Mr. spoil it. Okay. You'll find out later. Yep, I'll find out when we get to it. You'll be surprised who it actually is. It's someone actually, someone actually you know. Yeah. Besides the color, I can't tell the difference. No more for you. I'll stress myself. That's okay. I did buy them for you after all. Thanks. But why? Well, life's been pretty crazy lately. We haven't had any time to relax, so I thought I might want to munch on something to de-stress. If you say that now, you're, you're just going to tease me and call me fat. <laughs> really? Yes. Though, thanks. It's not quite stress, but I was definitely nervous. This is my first chance to stop and take a break since this all began. I'm glad. And anyway, the other people in the 99 Regiment sure are strange. Yeah, I thought that nights would be serious and almost sink like life. But C Cutter Clubhouse is the only one who fits that stereotype so far. Rusty is, is all over the place. And Ar Archibald is serious, but... She's, she's a little, uh, weird. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> but, but they all seem like good, good people. I think they do too. So these, those are, these are knights, basically. Just so you know, every, every, every time we get a new character on our party, all of the villains discuss them out sort of thing. Yeah, let's do our best tutorial. Which the thing goes also with someone like, say, like, Hilda. Which, yes, you do get as an ally later on, and as well as other characters. Which I also have a special... I see that she has all the skills that they will unlock from later on. For Hilda's case, she, she you get her actually level 30, basically, later on. Oh, Gizzy is another okay. ally. Enemy. Too big. Mm -hmm. Those are, those are actually two. So there's Hilda and Dante. <laughs> there are the names of the other two characters. Here we go. Here's, here's basically the Harbingers. So you have Hilda, the Witch of Destruction, who's actually the leader. Dante, who's basically her, like, sort of a right man, you know, kind of, you know, guy, basically. Dorothy, who is basically one of the, one of the little one, the little lolly who actually wields chainsaws. She's actually the psychic. She's kind of sort of a, I guess, think she's a, she's a psychotic little you know, girl. And then Hrodoff, who actually is a, 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 gener, a, gener, a formal general who betrays, which actually you'll find out much later on. Especially, especially, you'll find out about him during the Earth Witches, you know, chapter arc. But he, he's, he's unique in his own right. Everyone is accountable. Those who are not dead are in a dream. Hey, Hilda, let me hear your song. I want to see these sturdy people turn into beefy jewels. Jewels, huh? I guess the way we trap them is almost like a game. A third will come for us soon. Hilda, we must hurry. Right. Then I'll be in. All of you, patrol the area. Understood. No, nobody's going to interrupt you at this time. I won't let anyone get in my way. Not until the whole world has been filled by my son. So, here's the thing. There's actually a reason why, actually, why Hill's actually doing this. You actually find out the real reason why, by around chapter 8, it's revealed that Hilda was doing something. The Nolan village of Vyvian had been crystallized. Another one. Make a case. Yeah. Have you any survivors? My deep, deepest apologies, Your Majesty. There are none that remain. Yeah, this game. It 
That just reminds me of Big Train Order. Uh, sort of, but it's not. You could be. Yeah, just. It's, it, it, does have a, it has a story actually that's really good about as good as Fate Grand Order. Yep. I think maybe it's maybe because of the art style. Yeah, I can definitely see that. Oh, actually, Fire Emblem has, has art, that kind of art style. So here we go. Each of those actually represents a chapter. So one, two, so two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just so you know, once once all those actually disappear, that means basically now the eight chapters have now begun. So this is now the first chapter, which means now chapter two now will begin. Chapter now on chapter one end. Yep, chapter two. This is now that this means now is it for the series is it for the stream? Thursday will begin actually we'll, Thursday we actually will begin chapter four. In fact, I'll do a little bit. I'll open up the game at least decide let the intro kind of play. But basically, here's what's gonna happen type of thing. I will go ahead and every single time we get a chance to unlock a new character, I will go ahead and show off that character a little bit. All right. Which I'm, which I'm, or okay. I'm for instance, in instance, since I've already showed Archibald. Let me go up with this new type of thing. Just so you know, I'm not going to reveal who you actually get later on. Right. Yeah. This is the intro type of thing. So, so Archibald. I'll put it off to the side. Rusty and Claws. Lizette, I'm not going to show up yet until after, like, I believe another certain chapter where Lizette gets her true power. There's. There's also there is also a certain which is the same with same goes with Hilda, who I will not show off until later on. Same with so basically there are three characters in particular I actually will not show off until again like allies truly, or at least have their true abilities revealed, which is basically Alto, Lizette. Though Alto I could probably show off a little bit, but I'm not going to a little bit because Alto's abilities all get revealed by the end. Right. Yeah. But like basically Alto, Hilda, and the set I will reveal later on for certain stuff in certain certain events. For everyone else, I will reveal as soon as I should get them. Alright. Okay. And basically the golden ticker as well as this your golden ticker is trying to beat Hilda, which destruction. So it feels like so it feels like the whole anime intro type of thing, which is really kind of good. I kind of, kind of like it in a way. So honestly, I recommend if you get a chance to just play this game. Now, mind you, I play this game on New Game Plus at the moment. So, if anything, what I recommend, play this game and try to go for it, try to beat it however you want, whichever way you want. Yes, there are also there's actually two different endings, but there are some are not much different type of thing. But one ending in particular has you actually choose actually the fight. The final boss normally, and the second one I was, I was actually do actually the same thing you do without this entire game, which in fact is actually Tune, which is the main gimmick of this game, in particular with the witches. All right, I can't reveal to anyone yeah. of a thing, but there are two different final battles. In this, in this other other final battle, when you, you when you actually fight the soul of the being itself, and trust me. Yeah, it's actually crazy, and also kind of why in particular the final and the final boss in particular. Is definitely catchy. Final boss music is definitely one of the catchy themes, and honestly, the entire soundtrack is amazing. Now, if you want to be spoiled by it, you can avoid it. You can wait maybe until after I beat the game to listen to the soundtrack, or if you want to listen to the soundtrack now, you can do that without any context. All right. Just so you know, all the, a lot of the witch, all the songs, in particular like the witch's song, a certain theme by a certain character I can't reveal, which is a bit of a spoiler, as well as also, so yeah, basically. The five witches have ten songs, in particular, two songs each. These songs are all actually sung in Japanese. There's actually no, there's the, there's no English translation for them. All right. Okay. There's no English translation. There's no English translation for them. All right. All right. That'll be it for this. That'll be it for this stream. If you guys enjoyed it, mm -hmm. you can understand this is actually the beginning. I enjoyed beginning. it. It's actually the beginning actually of a Looks really like good, a cool game, actually. Really good game. Mind you, this is the reason why I, why I saved this game for a stream 100 purposely. 
I wanted, I wanted to make my 100th game series be special. All right. Ooh. And why not? Why, why yeah. not sell a glow? And also, here's the funny part. 101 is actually literally Super, super, super Paper Mario. The first Paper Mario game I've ever actually really played. So, hey, two special games at the right time. Perfect timing. So, Thursday, so Wednesday, so Thursday, we'll continue onward with this game. Perfect? Yep. I'll see you guys then. Peace. Yeah, see you then. Bye, guys. See you next time.